They call him Jesus. He came to love. He'll ever forgive. He lived and died to buy my pardon and empty grave is there to prove my Savior. Cause he lives, I can face tomorrow because he lives. All fear is gone because I know who holds the future and life is worth. Well, there she is sitting on my next project that I want to try to do. Oh, well. I'm just going to have to get over it. Alrighty, let's see what our next Bible verses are. <clears throat> we got Exodus 35. Alright, here we go. And Moses gathered all the congregation of the children of Israel together. And said unto them, These are the words which the Lord hath commanded, that ye should do them. Six days shall thy work be done, but on the seventh day thou shalt be to you a holy day, the Sabbath of rest to the Lord. Whosoever doeth work therein shall be put to death, and ye shall kindle no fire throughout your habitation upon the Sabbath day. Go shut that door. I, I, this is something I do not understand. About why you should be put to death for doing something on the Sabbath. Alright. And not even start a fire? How are you supposed to start a fire? In the winter time, sit there and freeze. That's something I'm, I'm really confused about here. I'm telling you, I am. All right, and Moses spoke to all the congregation of the children of Israel, saying, "This is the things which the Lord commanded, saying, uh, Take ye from among you an offering unto the Lord. Whosoever of, the, of a willing heart, let him bring it. An offering of the Lord, gold and silver and brass." and blue and purple and scarlet and fine linen and goat's hair and ram skin dyed red and badger skin and shittim wood and oil for the light and spices <clears throat> for the anointing oil and for the sweet incense and oxen stones and stones to be set for the ephod and for the breastplate and every wise hearted among you shall come and make all that the Lord hath commanded, and the tabernacle, his tent, and his com covering, his tatches, and his boards and bars, his pillars, and his sockets, the ark, and the stave thereof, with the mercy seat, and the veil of the covering, and the table, and its sta staves, and all the vessels, and the showbread, and the candlestick also for the lightning, and the furniture, and the lamp, and the oil for the light, and the in incense, uh, and the incense altar, and his staves, and the anointing oil, and the sweet incense, and the hanging for the door at the entering of the tabernacle the altar of burnt offering, and his brazen grate, his staves, and all his vessels, the laver, and his feet, the hanging of the court, his pillars, and the sockets, and the hanging for the door of the court, the pins of the tabernacle, and the pins of the court, and the cords, the cloth of service, to do service in the holy place, 
the holy garment for Aaron and the priest, and the garments of his sons to minister in the priest's office. And all the congregation of the children of Israel departed from the presence of Moses. And they came every one whose heart was stirred him up, and every one whom his spirit made willing. And they brought the Lord's offering to do the work of the tabernacle of the congregation for all his services and for all the holy garments. And they came both men and women, as many as were willing, willing hearted, and brought bracelets and earrings and rings and tablets, all jewels of gold. And every man that offered, offered an offering of gold unto the Lord. And every man with whom was found blue and purple and scarlet and fine linen and goat's hair and red skin and rams and badger skin brought them. <coughs> Everyone did offer an offering of silver and brass brought the Lord's offering and every man with whom was found shittim wood for any work of the service brought it. And all the women that were wise-hearted will did spin with their hands and brought that which had spun, both a blue and a purple and a scarlet and fine linen. And all the women whose hearts started them up in wisdom, wisdom spun goat's hair. And the rulers brought oxen stone and stones to be set for the ephod and for the breastplate, and spices and oil for the light and for the anointing oil and for the sweet incense. And the children of Israel brought a willing offering unto the Lord, every man and woman whose heart made them willing to bring all manner of work which the Lord had commanded to be made by the hand of Moses. And Moses said unto the children of Israel, See, the Lord hath called by name Beales, the son of Uriah, the son of Hor, the tribe of Judah. And he hath filled him with the Spirit of God, his wisdom and understanding and the knowledge and all manner of workmanship, and to derive courses Horse work to the work in gold and in silver and in brass. And in the cutting stone he set them in a carving of wood to make any manner of cutting work. And he hath put in his heart that he may touch both he and a hobio, a, a holab. Okay. The son of Ahizamach of the tribe of Dan, whom hath he filled with wisdom of heart to work all manner of work in the engraving and the cutting workmen, <coughs> and of the in water, in blue and in purple and scarlet, and in fine linen, and the and of the we, uh, weaver. Even of them that do any work, and of them that those that devise cutting work. Alright, we're on 36. Then brought B, Z, L, and Aholab, and every wise heart of men, in whom the Lord put wisdom and understanding to know how to work all manner of work for the service of the sanctuary, according to all that the Lord had commanded. And Moses called Bezel and Abiho, or Abiyab, okay, and every wise-hearted man in whose heart the Lord had put wisdom, even every one whose heart stirred him up to... <coughs> <coughs> Alright. Stirred him up to come and to do work to do it. And they received of Moses all the offering which the children of Israel had brought 
for the work of the service of the sanctuary, to make it withal. And they brought yet unto him free offering every morning. And all the wise men that wrought all the work of the sanctuary came every man from his work which they had made. And they spoke unto Moses, saying, The people bring much more than enough for the service of the work which the Lord commanded to make. And Moses gave commandment, and they ceased it to be proclaimed throughout the camp, saying, Let neither man nor woman make any more work for the offering of the sanctuary. So the people were restrained from bringing. For the stuff that they, they had was so significant for all the work to make it, and too much. And every wise-hearted man among them that wrought the work of the tabernacle made a tent curtain of fine twine linen, and blue and purple and scarlet, with cherubims of cutting work made he them. The length of one curtain was twenty and eight cubits, and the breadth of one curtain was four cubits, and the curtains with all of the one size. And he coupled the five curtains one to another, and the other five curtains he coupled one to another. And he made a loop of blue blue on the edge of one curtain from the salvage in the coupling. Likewise, he made in the uttermost side of the other curtain in the coupling of the second. Fifty loops made he in one curtain, and fifty loops made he in the edge of the curtain, which was the coupling of the second. The loops held one curtain to another. And he made fifty latches, patches of gold and coupled the curtains one to another with the patches. So it became one tabernacle. And he made curtains of goat's hair for the tent over the tabernacle, even the curtains he made them. The length of one curtain was thirty cubits, and four cubits was the breadth of one curtain. The eleven curtains were of one size, and he coupled five curtains by themselves and six curtains by themselves. And he made fifty loops upon the utmost edge of the curtain in the coupling, and fifty loops made he upon the edge of the curtain which coupled the second. And he made fifty tatches of brass to couple the tent together, and that it might be one. And he made a covering for the tent of ram a skin dyed red, and covered the badger skin above that. And he made borders for the tabernacle of shittim wood, standing up. The length of the board was ten cubits, and the breadth of the board was one cubic and a half. And one board had two tendons equally distant one from another. Thus did he make for all the borders of the tabernacle. And he made boards for the tabernacle, twenty boards for each side southward. And forty sockets of silver he made under the twenty boards, twenty sockets under one board. <coughs> for his two ta ta talents and two sockets under the board for his two t uh, tendons, and for one, uh, one other side of the tabernacle, which towards the north, he made twenty boards, and their sockets of silver, two sockets under one board, and two sockets under the other board. And for the one side of the tabernacle westward, he made six boards, and two boards made he for the curtains of the tabernacle on two sides. And they were coupled beneath, and they coupled together at the head thereof, it to one ring. Thus he did to both of them in the, both the corners. And there was eight boards, and their sockets were sixteen sockets of silver under every board, two sockets. And he made the boards, bars of shittim wood, five for the boards, of one side of the tabernacle, and five boards 
for the boards on the other side of the tabernacle and five bars for the boards of the tabernacle for the side westward. And he made the middle bar to shoot through the boards from one end to the other. And he overlaid the boards with gold and made their rings of gold to be placed for the bars and overlaid the bars with gold. And he made a veil of blue and purple and scarlet and fine twine linen with the cherubims made he it of cutting work. And he made there thereunto four pillars of shimmer and overlaid them with gold and their hooks were of gold. And he cast for them four sockets of silver and he made a hanging for the tabernacle door of blue and purple and scarlet and fine twine linen of needlework and the five pillars of it with the hooks and he overlaid their carpenters and their fittings with gold but with their five sockets were of brass all right now we are done with these two and <clears throat> um And I, I wonder what ever happened to this tabernacle. I wonder where it's at. Alrighty. Well, we'll read 37 the next time. Tomorrow. Thank you, guys. Love you all. This is how to donate to my PayPal. You come down here to Poor Man's Sewing. And you mash on Poor Man's Sewing. Then you go over here to About... You mash on about, and right here is to donate to Poor Man Sewing.